Hey little bunnies. I know usually I put my intro at this part, but I feel like it just I'm just not in the mood to fake being really upbeat and happy because of what's going on right now. I'm trying to keep positive, so that's why I am doing this video while we're locked up in our houses, quarantined. We can all use like a little entertainment. I feel like YouTube does serve a purpose at this time just to keep us all entertained so we're not going stir crazy. I'm doing this not only for you guys to entertain you, but even just for me, just so I have something to do while we're quarantined and my job um, can't be working right now. Um, I know like a lot of people are in the same situation where they can't work right now, so they're just at home. So today I'm gonna be answering some hypothetical stranded on a deserted island questions. I thought it'd be kind of appropriate because we do feel a little stranded right now with the social distancing and just kind of being cooped up in our house. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to just answer some questions. So let's get on into it. So I just typed into Google like stranded on an island questions and I just came up with this website and it says, assuming your iPod was in a waterproof case and had longer than life battery and assuming certain items floated to shore in your wardrobe trunk, answer these following questions. Number one, what song on your iPod would you listen to first? How long was it ago was this this uh, page made? Because who has an iPod? Was this made in like 2005? Oh. Anyway, so iPod, number one song. So basically my favorite song would be Dreams by Fleetwood Mac. That would definitely be the song I listen to first. That song, it's weird. So every time I hear that song like randomly, like, like on the radio or if I'm like, at a place and they play Dreams with Fleetwood Mac or kind of just any Fleetwood Mac song, I feel like it's a, a guide telling me that like I'm in the right place at the right time. Like I don't know what it is about that song, but like if I hear that song somewhere, I know I'm on the right track. I don't know. Number two. So I'm looking down my iPod. iPod. My iPad is over here, so I'm reading the questions off of that. What book would you be happy you had read, had to read again and again? I, I can't read, apparently. Um, my favorite book is The Lovely Bones. I've read it several times. There is a movie that was made about it. Or like, it's the same. It's not quite as detailed, but yeah, that's like my favorite book. I like their interpretation of like what happens after death, like, like how everyone goes to their own type of heaven and then they, look down on and like watch the, the lives of the people that they love from wherever they're at. Yep. Number three, what shoes would you dig through in your trunk, find and never take off? Um, I really like my Vans, but they're like, okay, so like look wise, I like my platform Vans, but like they don't slip on easy. So probably like, my Nike flip-flops that have like that squishy like memory foam in them, those are really comfortable. If, if we're talking about a deserted island, island, I assume it's gonna be warm, so I would wear those. Number four, what would you most dream about eating again? Probably sushi, vegetable sushi, like avocado rolls. Number five, what would your six word life story be at the moment? I have my own concept of time. Okay, well that's seven, but just to quote uh, One Son by Miley Cyrus, that pretty much sums it up. Number six, what would you regret not packing the most? My puppy, assuming my puppy's not there. Yeah, I would regret not, pa not packing him. Number seven, after you woke on the beach, waterlogged and disoriented, what would you do first? find shelter and then food, assuming I don't have those things. Number eight, even though no one is with you, who would you pretend was with you? My puppy. Nine, what stuck on a desert island movie would you think about while you were there? The Descendants, for sure, the one with George Clooney. I always talk about this. My favorite movie, the very underrated movie, not the Disney one, the George Clooney one. And number 10, 
The, the question we always ask about when we're stranded on a deserted island, what three things would you bring? My puppy, my, I guess iPod, it, like it doesn't have to be a phone, like just I guess an iPod, working iPod so I can listen to music. So puppy, iPod to listen to music, I guess a charger. So I had fun just answering these hypothetical questions. Uh, I'll leave the link to this website down below so you can answer the questions. Maybe answer some of the questions in the comments to start a conversation. Like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, all that, and I will see you little bunnies in the next one. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.